a poem for the forest bathing children. The Japanese word for forest bathing is shinrin-yoku. It means absorbing the forest by being in it. At the sanctuary in fall, volunteers hide small painted pumpkins for children to find along the paths where birds visit small ponds to take their baths. The forest, you see, is a life-filled place where deer dawdle and foxes race. In winter, bears hibernate, sleep, and snore. People come in all seasons to forage and explore. Bats flutterfly silently, filling many needs. They feed on mosquitoes, pollinate plants, and disperse seeds. In summer, children crawl on their hands and knees to watch tiny bugs, then reach to climb on low-branched trees. Curious critters watch from hiding places. As one squirrel runs, another chases up and down and around a hollow trunk. Inside it lives a docile skunk. It eats nuts and berries and nibbles mushrooms. The same foods eaten by possums and raccoons. Lynx and bobcats may venture here, but they're a very rare sight. They avoid places where people go, mostly come out at night. It is a miracle to share the forest with so many marvelous creatures. If we watch and learn their beautiful ways, they become our wildlife teachers.